hello everybody and welcome back thank you for joining me for another episode of omega strike a fun retro inspired metrovania in where you get to be one of three different distinct characters in your battle to stop dr omega in his evil schemes i do believe there is going to be a boss up here shortly which is going to be interesting what kind of power up or ability are we going to get or are we going to get another heart container what is the boss going to be and it looks like it's going to be a giant ape that's kind of cool so we meet again your persistence is admirable even though it is utterly futile you've arrived just in time to witness my latest experiment this ancient forest guardian has stood here petrified for thousands of years. Let's see if we can spark some life into the old chap. Well, that's kind of cool. And in the last episode, I did talk that I thought it was going to be some kind of animal boss. And I was correct. It's alive, alive. It doesn't look very pleased to see you let the battle begin okay well let's let's see what oh he has like hey you know well i guess it's a forest guardian so i guess he can have lasers i was thinking it was just an ape and i'm like you know what an ape should not have laser abilities that just doesn't seem right but i do believe oh we're gonna have to jump over those i think would be better if we jumped over those instead of just got hit by them so let's see if we can do a little bit about better about jumping over those. Maybe not. We will need to get a, let's get a Big Mac here and use that up. And hopefully we could run a little bit better here. I would really like to get some more or take less damage here. Avoid these a little bit better there we go oh that one came right quickly okay they're also taking off i noticed that he's taking off ouch a half health point instead of a or two hits instead of one hit which is going to mean that the guys are going to get the bosses are going to get a little bit stronger from now on i do believe oh that was a bad bad decision and we're going to have to get us a, another hamburger here I believe yes we do okay oh ugh, shoot these rocks are actually they're coming at like a perfect time to get hit it's like one of the other bosses where they were shooting in a particular pattern so that it was harder to avoid them he's gonna drop here probably shortly and do yep Ugh. it's just they're coming in a wave in which yeah those last three are pretty close together which makes it a lot harder to avoid and we're down to our last little oh no i hit the wrong button i switched game over let's continue there and see if we could do a little bit better this time we're gonna have to not only up our game in avoiding those shots but we're also going to have to uh, avoiding the rocks we're gonna have to get a little bit better and quicker on our healing here let's see if we can get this guy i don't also really want to be below him when he drops so we're going to take this a little bit get a little bit of hits on him but we're really because if he drops and lands on us that's another two hits right there see it was two hits and now i'm stuck against this wall here really in a not good position unfortunately that got a couple hits on us there we go we got over that one that's i'm gonna worry more about getting over these rocks than trying to hit him i want to hit him up in the air i think would probably be the best idea here I think would be better to try to do that than try to shoot him let's just avoid this the best we can and if we could switch quickly if I can get that quick switch 
out uh the double jump guy would be a lot better for avoiding those rocks but i'm afraid his shotgun is not going to have the range that his gun does that's going to make it a lot easier to hit him that's what i'm worried about looks like we're doing a little bit better here we want to kind of avoid him as best we can like i said i don't want to be under him because that just means that when he drops he gets a free hit on us so we almost want to do a little bit of hits and then run away and just take our time at it i think would be the best Ooh, okay it is actually faster than we are but we're doing a little bit better than we did last time which is good there we go i wonder if he's also going to switch it up a lot of the bosses had a kind of a secondary characteristic or a secondary ability to, with lack of a better term i really i was gonna say i don't really want to be stuck there in the corner okay like at half health or lower they started doing something different changed up their tactics a little bit and i'm wondering if he is going to do that or maybe he's just going to be thrown out or staying up in the air a little bit less that's gonna that's our time to hit him when he's up there and if he stays up there less each time and does this it's going to be harder for us to hit him come on get a couple hits in there i think i'm gonna wait him out now he's gonna do i want to be over on this side there we go nice we're so still only doing four of these but again those last two are fairly quick together we're doing a lot better here now that's good like to save those cheeseburgers as much as i can the extra hearts does help we're not just a shy slower than these rocks we're almost got him down this is good we got health we got the cheeseburgers still so i'm not incredibly worried right here but we'll just make sure i don't want to kind of get over confident there wow okay that's actually the best we've done so far against the boss a full health here that looks like a power up what, what it is power grip while controlling sarge jump onto a pipe to grab a hold of it we've uh, discussed this too i thought that that sarge's ability i assumed that all the other characters would get an ability so that's kind of interesting as well that they're giving it back to sarge i don't know if they give it to whomever has the or whomever you're playing there we go so yeah he grabs a hold of that i don't know that would mean that they would have extra animations in there if they gave it to whoever whoever was fighting whoever you were fighting at the time fighting with at that time now that put us out here which means we're gonna we're, there's a few areas that we're gonna go ahead and this is not the really the power up that i wanted either unfortunately i was hoping for one that would blow up the rocks but eh i guess we kind of get what we get here there are there's one kind of right above us and then there's a couple back through it looks like different oh, oh shoot there was that way too i'm not sure if we can go back up that way i would like to if it allow us there was actually one right as before i entered the boss area that was another step off so let's see if we can go back up here i believe we probably could we just got to i don't know if he could make oh i was a little worried about that if he'd be able to make that jump they've done really well with letting me go how i wanted to and that's really cool with kind of an open world perspective that if i wanted to go this way or that way it will let me do that just like i'm coming back through it's kind of letting me come back through 
So I don't know if Sarge is going to get all the power ups or not. That's an interesting distinction and an interesting change here. So right over here, I believe, was another way we can go. Let's get Bear to push that out of our way. Jump. And right here was a place that we haven't been, which of course is blocked off with rocks. Yay! Okay, these are the rocks that I got to figure out how to explode yet. There's, there's no way that I have found yet to get through those so uh, that's going to be an interesting thing that we're going to have to come back through and pick up at some point is to go through there's been several ways that have been blocked off by those rocks and i and for as many as the rocks versus the pipes i would have thought we would have got the way to get rid of the rocks first but they gave us the pipes so we're going to have to figure out how this is going to help us get through an area to get, I mean, essentially a, another boss. That's where we've gotten the power up. So I'm not sure. I, there's only been a couple places that I recall having this. So I'm not sure if it's really going to help us out that much, but we'll... We'll see, we'll have to just kind of keep going and see, and we never know what's so far in the treasure chest. It has always been gold, but I don't know if it will continue to be that way. So that's gonna be interesting to see what that's going to be. I wanted to check, not that the map here. Yeah, so over a little bit and then up. Go. where is it so yeah we're gonna have to actually go way up and around that's a little bit of the annoying thing here is that the wow oh, these frogs are gonna be a little annoying here gonna lay down and just lay down and lay down the firepower there there we go that these the way this world has been set up is that you let's see if I can say this correctly is this the way I want to go? Yeah, it's the way I want to go. You have a choice in some aspects. Most of the time, one way is a short cutoff, while the other way has is a the long way, the right way to go. And sometimes that's frustrating because if you choose the right way to go then you've got a long time to come back around to get back to that spot just like we were here we're gonna switch up to out uh, now alex i can't remember his name i'm so bad at that there you go i think it's Al alex baron sarge if i remember correctly Oh, I can't kill those guys. Yeah, I got hit. Good thing for invincibility frames or I would have got hit twice there. Yes, okay, so over two more and we are there. Can he kill these frogs in a timely manner? Uh oh, the bee's gonna get me. I'm not careful, there we go. So I would suspect that like the best way to do this, like from now on kind of perspective, would be to go a little bit one way and if it looks like the full way the right way to come back a little bit and then do this little shortcut because this is probably just going to be oh gosh there's another turtle over there yeah that's exactly what i thought it was gonna just be a little short section offset and that is probably would be the best way to go through it is if i'm seem to be going the right way go back and go back the other way probably would be your best bet here Ooh, i need the coin i need all the coins how much coinage do we have 228 that means that we can get at least one more power up here oh chase this frog down Ooh. here we go 
that one more power up is going can i just drop here oh that kind of ended up not doing well for us but kind of did it just let us we got a little bit of damage here but we typically get enough of the chicken legs that we are usually okay i just gotta still be careful i wouldn't run around and just go crazy but it yeah i think usually you get enough chicken legs that it's not going to be a big worry here can i get that guy i'm not sure yeah i did sweet i do like these little shortcuts once you get the power-ups that's kind of nice as well where am i now so we need to go in like an s pattern here are they just gonna yeah you guys jump that way that would be very nice for me oh nope Oh yeah, let's stand on the B. That's gonna help me out. <laughs> Here we go. I don't know. I haven't picked up any chicken legs recently, but we've better. Yeah, here we go. Speak of the devil. We need to go. I'm gonna try to get some of these guys in the hopes of getting a chicken leg. Let's just drop down here and whoop. Ah, wow, that didn't help me out very much, did it? Ooh, let's not drop down there. Come on, get him. Here we go. Oh, we are just shy of being able to shoot that guy. And again, I want to try to get these chicken legs if we can. So that's kind of why we're going back through here and killing these guys. Wow, we're not doing very good at it, though. The If we get back to the tumbleweed or tumblewood, we should be able to... Can I just jump over there? There we go we should be able to heal up i don't i'm assuming that the priest when they give us another health we will oh there's another one oh that's a med kit when we get filled up on our health we will also get our when we get another health life cube thingy we'll get filled up as well that's what i'm thinking i'm not sure about that but that's what i would have to i guess hypothesize on there we go that b is going to be a pain i'm the, yeah his his position there was not ideal for my can i get yeah there we go i was hoping that that's exactly what i wanted to do go and then he should come straight across there we go one more and then we can go i really would like to get rid of that guy too he's a little annoying like one of those enemies that you can't kill he just sits there and is in your way all the time i'm hoping for gosh that's another block well i think it's gonna be we're down to that's the only thing that is needed now is that one power up Okay, so we go through and there's another up we can go across this way and see what we get over there there i think this is where oh yes yeah this is where the helicopter guy is that's where i thought it was emerald woods i don't yeah we weren't this way at all in the last episode going through we're just kind of in the metroidvania part of the game right now trying to figure ah, gosh another one of those does it appear to be in there appears to be a pit over here that it doesn't look like we checked out oddly enough so let's see what's down here oh well that's why wow so everything so far is blocked off in the emerald woods by that those rocks so let's see if we can i know that there was somewhere at tumbleweed that we can get so let's run back tumbleweed yes we do we still need to go to the blackstone mine so i'm a, there's a few things that we need still need to collect and i don't think that we have gotten the device that we needed to get yes i want another little 
Your maximum health has been increased, but it did not heal me up. That's interesting. Extra firepower. So we want, let's do, I wonder if the lot damage, if it's a double damage thing, that would be a very interesting. Let's grab, if I have to have that fully powered up, let's go and grab that. Maybe not my best choice here, but that's what I'm thinking. Okay, that's the guy's house. That's the meat guy. We probably should grab some meat here. Was it in this bunker that I needed to talk to the guy? I believe so. There we go. Have you found the decryption? I don't think, yeah, I haven't found the decryption device, which is really what I need here. So I guess we're gonna continue on here and see what else we can find. There was, I thought, in Tumblewood. There we go, that's kind of nice. We need a couple more of those, really what we need. There was somewhere, I do believe, in Tumblewood where there was the pipe. And let's see if we can run over here really quickly and find that. It might not be where I thought it was. Here we go. We need to just come back through tundle, Tumblewood so that we get these power-ups is really what we need to do. Maybe it wasn't Tumblewood. Maybe it was, yeah, don't think it's this way. I don't recall what it was now. Oh, wonder if it was the mountain. Let's see, Blackstone Mountain is, that's this way. Not Blackstone Mountain, Cloudtop Mountain. I think that's this way. It may have been there, I do not recall right off, but we're just gonna have to go back and search, really is what we need to do. That's like, all of the metroidvanias you just go and look and see where you where you've been and what you could do i need to get yeah okay it's out it's up a little bit further get these get all those coins as much as we can here yeah we're in cloud top mountain i was thinking it was this way somewhere but I don't recall, and I was thinking it was right off the helicopter, but again, I might be wrong on that. I don't see it here. So I don't recall where that is at all. And that's a little frustrating to know that there was that spot there that I can't get to. Not Tumbleweed Desert. Was it, the, it wasn't the resistance caverns. That's all found out. Tumbleweed Desert is all found out. Cloud Top Mountain is all found out. So Emerald Woods and... Let's go back to Emerald Woods and go into the military base. I believe is probably what we... Maybe it was the military base, the beginning of the military base. This is the problem I have with Metroidvania is I can never remember where anything is once we have to start going back through stuff. Shouldn't take me too long. Wow, that really, well, let's not get in there. I was gonna say, that was a nice little drop there. Get me through this area quicker. We get a hit, a little hits, it'll be all right. Couple hits will be all right. No, almost back through here. There was an area in one spot, I think that had the, shoot, where was that? Again, I don't know where it was. There we go, we're all filled back up. It was, it wasn't the military, I think it was the mines, to be honest with you, but I don't see anything that's, has an opening there in the mines. There was a place that I do remember that I needed a pipe to cross the area. Well, we might just have to go off camera a little bit and see if we can 
find what we need to find and then come back because we don't want to waste all the time just trying to look for something here that was blocked yeah that was blocked off from that oh wait there we go we can try bearer's gun there nope so that's not it that was that okay well there we go let's try bear for a little bit his little pellets are a lot bigger than what they used to be let's go into yeah see that no nope, can't go down that way hmm again i think that's some kind of tnt or something like that that i think is going to be the thing that's going to work there okay well let's run ah there is some yeah there is well there's only one opening i see in the military base and i do recall it being what it is it's these rocks i think that what we're gonna do here is go ahead and end this episode i'm gonna run around a little bit and see what i if i could find what i'm looking for find out where we need to go and then i will be back thank you so much for watching i do appreciate it and i will see you all next time bye everybody